Okay, uh, calibrating the new 110 XI4 printers is pretty much the same as calibrating the older versions of the XI series printers. Uh, the menu looks a little bit different. So we go into the setup exit key and keep on pressing next. Until we come to meeting and ribbon calibrate, and we press the plus key as it's indicated right here by the plus sign. That tells us to go ahead and load just the backing of the paper. So we strip off the label from the liner. back up paper so that only liner is in the printer and if you look back here there's only liner underneath the sensor also notice that the sensor is lighted now so you have a good idea of where the, the sensor is tracking go ahead and close the print head and press the plus time sign to continue says to remove the ribbon. Again, you don't have to remove the ribbon entirely. Just slide it over to the right, as indicated here, to expose that light away from the ribbon. Close the print head. Press continue. Now it will calibrate. And then it says to reload all. So open up your print head, pull the paper through as you would normally, close the print head, straighten out your ribbon, straighten it out a little bit, close the print head, then press the plus sign to continue. Now in this case it came right up to top of form and it has calibrated. To see how well it's calibrated, you can go back a button and see the sensor profile. Press the plus sign to print. You'll see a nice, good, even baseline with spikes indicating gaps between labels. When you have good significant gaps between the labels, that means you've got a good calibration. Okay, this procedure that I just showed you is the long calibration or voltage calibration procedure. It's different than the procedure that many are used to where you pause the printer, you're loading new paper, it's a different size, and you press the calibrate button. That procedure calibrates the printer for the new length of paper that is going into the printer. The long calibration procedure calibrates the printer in voltages. So it will adapt itself to the new liner and the new type of paper that is going into the printer. So as you can see, there's a difference. Voltage versus memory.